My name is Ali Kaiser, and Mark and I have been living in E2 for eight years now. So we are full-time missionaries in E2 Brazil. I'm, I'm one of those people that is a recovering um, How do you call rotulista, like a categorizer, like I'm a recovering, um, you know, labeler of people. And, um, and so if you had told me 10 years ago that in 2015 we would have a housing project for homeless and um, the ONGI and lunch at our house for homeless for five years, I, I, I could even accept what you were saying, but I wouldn't imagine it being the way it is now. Um, because what's happened along these years has been, I have more and more and more seen myself in them. And so, you know, when you're dealing and when you're relating with um, homeless, our homeless friends, guys and girls, um, you, you realize that in so many ways you have the exact same patterns as they do, except their drug of choice is crack. Um, and ours is ego and pride and so many other things, you know? Um, but, but I also live in a cycle of relapse <laughs> and recovery. Um, and I think what it's done, the way it's shaped my faith is I understand a lot more grace. Um, and you know, one of, one of the words associated to our, to the nonprofit, to the ONGI work a lot of times is hope. Like, oh, you give these people hope, you know, you're, and, and I hope so. <laughs> Like, I think that's an element of what happens, but I also like to define this by grace in the sense that they don't have to change for us to keep doing this, you know? 